Hey there everyone! Welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy 13. My name's Porklift, I'm with Waddy Adam H. Bomber Guy. What the crap? Ah! <laughs> chickens! What? Pillow fire. Dad signature! <laughs> <laughs> you will be destroyed! What's the chuck of the theme again? Dance. <laughs> I was about to joke they were doing the forbidden dance, and then they did. <laughs> Delirious. Okay, the thing that I get when the Chocobo theme resolves. Lightning has stopped. Um... We good? Um. Yeah. The thing that I always get when the Chocobo theme resolves is I start feeling it in, like, kind of like in sixes. And then, okay, because I go. <laughs> like, th those two go together in my head. I used to get um, the uh, Star Wars uh, Empire theme and Ground Force. I can completely understand yeah. that! I used to have the. <laughs> completely unable to remember the funeral march because it would always turn into the Empire theme. <laughs> uh, then again, I always have problems with anything that's like s three straights on bass. So like boom, boom, boom. Because that always goes boom, into... Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, that always ends up as another one bites the dust. Which is terrible as a bass player because lots of tunes actually have three crotchets and then a thing. <laughs> like, it's really Why common. is this here? Jump. There's so even, can, like, little jump points. So you can overlook the area. Yeah. Look at that view, wow. Oh, 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 right, you can go down. Thought for a second we were, uh, if we were uh, game over. Uh, and I can go down and then the camera won't, oh no, no, the camera will do something. Okay, so you can't jump forward again. You can just go down one for no reason. What the fuck, game? Like, for a second I thought you'd actually manage to clip off the level and fall. <laughs> yeah. Someone doubt that's possible in this game. Yeah, yeah, that was the thing. Like, it seemed so impossible, but it seemed it's like you'd done it. It's way too polishedly... Yeah. ...forcing you -ness <laughs> Polishedly <that>. forcing you -ness. <laughs> <laughs> You mean linear. <laughs> It goes beyond linear. Yeah. You got surprised by that dancing What's bird. Skatetni. Well. Skatetni. Skatetni. We've been talking about harlequins. Hmm. <laughs> so it's a harlequin bird. Like actually looks. Yeah. All oh, right. I see. That's not a bird noise. Yeah. It was like a... That was. <laughs> well, maybe that was one of those seagulls outside. <laughs> Who knows? Bird noise. <laughs> the darkness. I believe in a thing called love. Trust us with the rhythm of a heart. The trust we make it down. We can make it down the sun goes down. I don't even think I love. Wait, that's how you. Yeah, so you could go down there. The shit! Ah, <laughs> oh, so it wasn't. It was you not pressing buttons good enough. You can do it, but only if you let the camera clip. <laughs> Horribly. So obviously we're going this way. Yeah. Aha, ball. Try and run past the creature. Is it possible to just like dodge these things? Yeah, yeah but, but not worth it. And also, like, you can't pick up items when there are enemies around. Hmm. And what is what is Final Fantasy without the fights? Yeah. The fights are the only gameplay in this game. <laughs> yeah. I just realised that the Skatani have different quilts. No, oh, that is I cool. think that's that will be different enemy types with different enemies. What's the other one called? The so far it's only been a The Skitani. other one is called Skitini. Really? That's less creative than I'd expected. Yeah. Well they are supposed to be like related to Yeah. But often the, the, it'll just be called like the ice skittini. Ah, that's skittini. not what I meant to switch to. Never mind. They are now called Suxy and Foxy. Because that isn't in the 
damage your at all. <laughs> it took me way too long to figure out that word. What word? <laughs> what is that thing that Forklift is always being? <laughs> um. <laughs> These birds take a long time to kill. Oh, you switched to medics for you, so you kind of feel some fun. Staggered! Dying at the same time. Oh, it is, it is, it's sticky. Yeah, that's kind of different. It doesn't, ha it doesn't have an yeah. apostrophe, for one thing. Yeah, it's harder to say. <laughs> is it stickini? I, uh, stickini, that, <laughs> that sounds like an oh, Italian... Oh, yeah, Nancy bit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, was well, it? It's a bit Beauty weedy, yellow polka dot stickini. Yellow what is with that blue thing? stripes, I think. Oh, yellow <laughs> with blue stripes stickini. There you go. What is. Yeah! Ooh. See? We got a trophy Lore for master. figuring out the pronunciation. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what did we yeah. get that for? <laughs> Oh god, they're gonna see all of your <laughs> all of your trophies for those horrendous porn games that definitely exist on the PS3. <laughs> well, discern the full attributes of a hundred enemies. For example. Oh, hey. did you discern them just by your party learning them? Yeah. Like, excellent. That That's is the most silly trophy. Because surely I that, think that just was a happen. gold trophy too. You fought a hundred enemies. Yeah, yeah really? easily. I've only no noticed like twenty. <laughs> Yeah, it's but very, some of them are recolors of each other. That's true. And some of the recolors are actually genuinely fairly different enemies. Mm. But this back... also goes back round to the same place. The fuck game. <laughs> I don't understand. It's I like it's under trying vaguely to look non-linear, but it just doesn't do anything. Even though there's an arrow on the map, this is confusing. <laughs> <laughs> I think you might go down here. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. We meant to go down the yellow bit, but we could go down here instead because it's exactly like the other bit, but in a different place. Yeah. That's now in my head and <coughs> going to be in my head forever. What were those things on its back as well? Like a bunch of different weird, cult, weird shaped blades. I didn't really notice that. We got 600 gil. That is so useful. Yeah, it is. We can buy things. Is this place not much with six hundred? I guess not. It's repeating in a fashion that is makes sense for a location to do, but not in a video game. Yeah. Yeah. Especially not one well, that, that is sort entirely of makes linear. Sense so where for are you a location going now, to do if it was a location that made sense in the first place, which this isn't. Yeah. If if it was As fun to do it this way, it would be smart, but it's. Just Especially because, thing. like, right now we're supposed to be in, like, an If arc. there was any obvious purpose to any of this, <laughs> it would make sense. Yeah. yeah. But we don't, like, we literally don't know where we are. We teleported here. Didn't yeah. We? Like, if there was any, like, excuse for them to be taking liberties, it's in this area. I mean, for a game, I was going Although to Although it is supposed to be a trial, so they are making it quite trying. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that is true. I was going to say, for a game designed um, in bits and then put together at the end, it looks like pretty well put together, like everything leads into it, but they didn't. They literally teleported here, didn't they, or something? Yeah. So, <laughs> That's the first... Uh, and actually, all of the locations have been, you are going from a place that is like one thing to a place that is like yeah, another thing. You will sort of go junk heap to lush forest <laughs> from no... Like, maybe, if they want to differentiate, they'll go junk heap, then you will move to another locate, like another yeah. section of the party and then when you go back the people who are in a junk heap are now in a rainforest yeah, and yeah. it's assumed that the journey from junk heap to rainforest made sense but you know it just happened off screen because well, it wasn't very interesting I guess up until this point they've no, disguised it no the only things well. that haven't been explained are like the blue foresty place yeah, yeah. Palum Forum no Palum no, wait, that was where they were going yeah sorry I can't get over these dancing birds and this one just chilling in the background. Yeah. Just sort of do -do 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 -do. That's the thing, what I just doing? died from decent health. No. No. These fucking birds. Oh shit, where are my notes? 26. 26. Um, where did I put my pencil? How is it just 26 by dying like <laughs> flies? And so. There it is. It was on the it was book. Sort of semi recent that the game got hard. Yeah. So it... Wasn't there a whole boss fight where even if you won, you lost? Did you game over if you lost to it? 
Probably. <laughs> but this game. 26. Who forbade it? Do these guys have a, a leader who's like, no, don't ever do this dance? Let's talk about crazy bird culture. Let's. Um, so why are these oh, birds here? Oh, peel me! <laughs> these birds are here because... You know because, what, fuck it, I'm bored. <laughs> um, actually, they are here due to a programming error. Because <laughs> everything was labelled ARC. And that is actually the sound they make. <laughs> and so they were pinned with the tag. Ah! And so when designing the arc, they disappeared. Yeah, they, they just put it in. I am using summons for that only logical purpose. I'm what bored. to give? Oh right, okay. That guy nearly decapitated lightning when he took out his thing. Yeah. Oh, how many guys have summons now? It, he, um, uh, lightning, lightning, Saz. Saz, yes. Yes, Saz. Awesome. And yeah. Snow. I think oh, that's yeah. it, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Okay, cool. yeah. Um. Saz has the fire one, and it's not Ifrit. Oh. Like it's the it is Ifrit, yeah. but it's a different name, and it turns into a sports car. And it has oh, stiletto yes. heels. And it has stiletto heels. We do this. <laughs> Petals. He got it when he when he was going to go kill Vanille. That also happened. All oh, right. Vanille Yay! revealed. Vanille revealed, that's right. a great phrase, yeah. <laughs> Vanille revealed that it was her and Fang's fault that Saz's kid got turned into a the sea. Right. And she expected Saz to freak out about it and like he pulls a gun on her and stuff and then he forgives her and then his summon comes out and then they are arrested <laughs> because Daz finds them and then fulfills his yeah. focus, turns into crystal. And evil Sarah Palin takes them away. You got three stars for that. That was amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, plot. <laughs> <laughs> plot that everyone else. Oh, congratulations! By the way, what? Yeah, that was that was nicely done. That was really impressive. Um, th three out of five stars. <laughs> it was done. We 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 finished. How many times can you do that again? Um, as soon as I get another TP, I'll be able to do it again. But then I'll need to have to well I'll have to recover three TP to do it again. Yeah. Wow. So you can really not do that. Shut up, Hope. We're taking it so slow. What? In fact, Moriad is backtracking yet again just because we can. And TP, <laughs> there are other things that it is used for that are probably more useful. Yeah. What does it get used for other than Quake? Because I don't even know what Quake is other than a game <laughs> and an engine. Um, there's a revival thing that uses it. Oh, really? There aren't even enough, like... Bosses or anything to warrant these all these summons, really. No, and in fact, summons seem to not be that useful. But yeah. maybe we're just not playing them right. Yeah, They're more useful than people to... think they are, but less useful than useful than they should be. Yeah, yeah. It took you quite a while to kill those things, even when you pulled out God. So, yeah. Odin, literally the king of the Norse gods. So. Yeah, with his pretty pony, which is definitely there. <laughs> the best bit is when he turns into a pony, and then like this moon is like, yay! <laughs> <laughs> Kneel before Odin and horse. That didn't do anything. <laughs> Onwards and upwards, my friends. <laughs> Let us continue through this arc. Well, technically, we're going downwards. Mm. You just ignore me. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was planning <laughs> on doing. <laughs> well, he's not wrong. Yeah. We have been going down. I don't like the. We, we haven't had. There's a boss. There's a boss. <laughs> I don't like the air in here. I wish you had. There's the a boss. Wish you... Although, actually, if this is the boss and the end of the location, this has been a relatively short dungeon. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's been this video, yeah. this like recording session. So I'm, an hour. I'm so off. glad you used the TP in the last. Are they planning yeah. To start a war? Oh. Actually, no. I think this is just like a a museum. In the museum. Yeah. Of actually, it's the centaurs. hibernatorium. Oh, they moved. That normal fights. Mother of balls, that is so cool looking. Please don't make us fight more than one. On your toes. <laughs> Not feet. Just toes. Okay. That's that's obviously a shield, stop attacking it. Yeah, god damn it, lightning and fang. Yeah. Like go round. I have a strange feeling they're gonna attack the shield no matter what. Yeah. 
Shoot. Okay, he's put it away now, so. Yeah. <laughs> this is a really cool enemy design, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. There's a flying it's, sword. Although it is like all robotic in the way that they're all really robotic, so trying to actually work out how the parts piece together is weird. Is, is that. That flying sword might be an enemy, I think. Uh, oh! Yeah. There's a, there's a flying sword hitting you. I just thought I might mention. I completely didn't notice because, yeah, especially when the camera's like this. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's like, I didn't realize that the sword was. Yeah, there. And occasionally you just get slapped by it. Uh, you need to heal. Yeah. Okay. I know it, it was mm. sensible to launch for as long as possible, but now you really need to heal. It kind of reminds me of uh, the design of some things in Twilight Princess. Like, um. Yeah, yeah, no, I, I can see that, the kind of twilight, yeah. but, but it's a little bit more colourful. Yeah, it has, a, it has a spine. It does, it has a yeah. Cage or something. And it's a kind of circular face with a massive headdress, kind of like the Midna one. I don't know what it is, but it's certainly pretty. Yeah, like, that's the thing, it's like, I don't know whether it's a good design, because I'm not sure what it's supposed to be, but it's a design I like. Help. Centaurian Blade. So the centaur was meant to be having it, and yeah. instead, disembodied hand has it. Centaurian. That's that's a terrible name. Yeah, it's the sort of thing a centaur would wield, clearly. Yeah. But why is it? I mean, centaurs basically just have regular human hands. Why do they yeah. need swords? They're special. I just like the idea that they're like someone bred an army of centaurs to like be officers of a hundred men just so that they could call them centaurians <laughs> the centaurian squad a century is a hundred years right yes yeah. and um a centurion is a roman officer and yeah a hundred men i always get mixed up because a millennia is not a million years it's, no it's not um two thousand one thousand one thousand i don't even know one thousand Numbers aren't my strong point. <laughs> How can you have 370% stagger? That's not 300% stagger, that's uh, 400 and whatever percent damage, and it's due to the stagger. stagger. When yeah. your gauge fills, it staggers, but the percentage is the percentage of damage you're doing. Yeah. Alright, so you're dealing 500 times the damage? Oh, percent. No, yeah, five, five, five times the damage. Yeah, yeah, five and a half times. Wow. Yes. The basic way to win every fight in this game is to get the stagger gauge up, so you launch them in the air, and, and then, then get as big a percentage as possible. So then your pea shooter is killing. Yeah. And basically, yeah, um, I'm trying to remember, is it, um, commandos stop the stagger gauge going down as much, ravagers make yeah. the yeah. Commandos also make everyone do more damage by existing, and ravagers make the thing go up faster by existing. Right, oh. okay, cool. There you go. I never cared about this. Right, one. let's fight another one of them. <laughs> let's, let's ignore them all completely. That one is not alive yet. What does this mean? I think maybe when you kill that one, two more come in. I don't know. What does that let's mean? See if you can get the drop on it. In the top right. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Take that, butt! <laughs> Oh, because that, oh uh, yeah, when you get the preemptive strike, they get really close to stagger. Yeah, yeah. So you can open the fight with a launch, which is really handy. Yeah. What does it mean when, just before you enter this battle on the top right, the screen sort of went glowy? Like the lens flare? Um, was that from, like, getting the preemptive strike? What are you? Are you sure it wasn't just the battle transition? Yeah, because, like, yeah, when, there, when, there is one that's a battle transition. I didn't know it's a different one, but if there was one, it was probably because we got a preemptive strike. No, like, before every battle ever. Oh, that's, yeah. that's when you're in the area of an enemy. Ah. Like, I, I thought it was when they noticed you, but I don't think it actually is. Oh. I think it's just when you're in the vicinity of an enemy. Mm. Which probably also means, like, when you're in the area in which you cannot be picking up an item. Is this a less difficult battle, or are you getting better at figuring out? There's no the sword this time. Blade. Oh, right. Which oh, yeah. you know was the problem was when um, what he had had it staggered and like was Launching. juggling it. The sword was progressively taking away his health, so he had to stop and heal, and the stagger gauge went down. Bad times for everyone. 
Yeah. <laughs> On top of that, you've got a 300 strikes. So. Yeah, exactly. This one. We're dominating. And by we, I mean, like, we, me and you are providing moral support. How does it unstagger? Does it when the gauge when the gauge goes down? Because if you hadn't noticed, the gauge is just yeah, going. Yeah. Like, even in normal battle, yeah. But is there a way you can just keep it permanently up? No, oh. the gauge just goes down once oh. it's staggered. Yeah. You can slow the stagger, uh, the gauge depletion, which is what we were talking about yeah. before. Yeah. But you can't stop it. Hey, ball. Yeah. Hey there, little ball. I think one of those creatures might have spawned in looking at the map. No, no, that's that that's your dude. Says... No, no, those, those are just the other people. Yeah, and the little red X is the last place you had a fight. Because for oh. some reason it feels the need to tell you where your last <laughs> fight was. <laughs> that's a weapon for him that prevents the staggering of enemies. <laughs> no. <laughs> I believe there is, like, one enemy at some point in the game, but if you stagger it, it does nasty things. Fair. But that's not a reason for a weapon which would have yeah. to be leveled up to be useful. Unless, yeah. of course, it's the final boss and this is a, like a critically important weapon. Yeah. A plot weapon. No, no, don't be. Saz is not critically important. The game designers did not base it around the idea that you will be using Saz. Saz is the black exploitation sidekick. Mm. Yeah, like. In a game where everyone is the main character, he is not a main character. Yeah. But he was. At the beginning, he was the sidekick of the main character, like Lightning. You know? Yeah, yeah. Now he's no one. But he has awesome development with Vanille, so yeah. that's cool. Yeah. That's good. Most yeah. of which you haven't seen. Uh, I've saw some of it, but yeah. not any of the crazy. Not any of the stuff where he finds <laughs> out she's basic. Or rather, she takes full blame for his son being a lassie, which actually isn't earned, and because he is smart, he realizes that she doesn't really deserve all the blame. Alright. Oh, Auto ability. Jeopardize. Thanks, game! No, 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 it said at the top. Oh, did it? Okay, sorry. Boost chain bonus of staggered the target upon attacking, so That's it, it means that yeah. uh, even as a commando, she's doing the job of a ravager once it's staggered. That's yeah. awesome. Hope's Crystarium just looks balls, even though he has every roll unlocked. <laughs> <laughs> I used to think a HP increase of 25 was good, but you have like 1500 HP per character now. Yeah, it all adds up. Yeah. And you get a couple of things each time. Oh yeah, that's true. What? Now that you have every character in the party, you're not going to have the times when it switches party to someone who you haven't crystallized with. No. So we're not going to get the... We are going to have... You just beat a boss, though. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But we're not going to have the sheer joy of realising we haven't <laughs> used snow for the entire game. <laughs> and being like, yes, we now can have everything. Oh. I forgot what Synergist does. Synergist is the um, positive buffs. Is it buffs, oh, rather, yeah. sorry. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah. It's positive status effects. It's the Bard. Hmm. Or the Green Mage. Or the. Whatever. Yeah. The White Mage abilities that no one uses when White Mages have them. Calling them by class um, names is. I know. 